Oh. What was that one? Front of the hand. Very good. It's the only one I picked today. <laughs> I just experimented with it in the back garden. Good on you, mate. That's quite how you learn. Morning legends, it is Friday the 9th of August at midday, late start to my vlog, even though I've been up for the best part of five hours, punching out content, I've just finished at the gym, Colin got my favourite Collingwood shirt on, I got my coffee, I got a sandwich for this afternoon, some water, I'm about to start six hours of coaching if this English weather doesn't ruin it. It is forecast to rain this afternoon. It was actually forecast to rain all day, but fortunately it's not raining at the moment, so I'm going to get at least a couple of sessions in. Meant to have six one on ones each, all going an hour. Busy afternoon. Um, this morning I published a couple of members' videos, um, which was good. Got something with Mike Hussey from the IPL when we met him, something with Liam Dawson, World Cup winner. Put them on the members' pavilion. Um, hopefully, this wind isn't too loud for you guys. Published something on LinkedIn, published something on Instagram. Did some video editing, got lots done. So here we are now, gym session done. Really pleased to have got back in there. And then six hours of coaching to go. Now here's a little fan. A little guilty. Something I might have spoken to you about before, or maybe I haven't, is about accelerating into the ball. I have? Okay, so what you was telling me back there, you... You, th you felt like because it was slow, you might pop it up in the air. Yep. So I reckon that's because you're, because it's so slow, you're still moving at a pace you're used to against the bowling machine or a faster bowler. Absolutely. So, and then you're slowing down or you're still through the same pace and you threw your shot too early. Yep. So you want to keep that same pace you're used to moving at. Yep. And you don't want to sort of move at the pace of the ball and go everything slow. The way you do that later. is move later. Wait, 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 wait. Let the ball get close to you then you can accelerate into the ball. Whereas if you're, if you're moving too early, all you can do is get there and stop. Yeah. Or you're way through, through your shot way too early. Yeah, there's, there's, yeah, I'll come on okay, so nice and still, I'm gonna throw them slow. I want you to try and hold in your stance nice and still, then accelerate into it. Yep. Take your time, take your time, reset every ball. We're not rushing, we've got time. Nice shot, single. Bad bowl. How's that for pace? This is perfect. The way it just dies. Pace, alright? Yeah. Perfect. Uh, so we're imagining keep her up. Could you have cut that ball? Bit of width? Obviously, there's not a lot of bounce, but I reckon a bit of width. Maybe you can try and get there and free your arms a bit. Yeah, yeah. Uh, you don't want to be going straight back with no pace. You can generate more pace by using your bottom hand that way. See, that was the same line, but too full to cut, so that was good. Yes. Good. As long as you get your weight across, that should be a low wrist shot. Even there, I reckon you were a bit early. A bit early, and then all you can do is stop. If you'd hold it, held longer, held your position, you maybe could have accelerated through that ball. Good. It's all right. You didn't do a lot wrong. It held in the wicket. You just probably slightly weights back. Rather than really getting, when there's no pace and bounce, you've really got to get over the ball. Yeah, so just, you're trying to almost sit too hard. Rather than, and when you try and go for power, you sort of sit back here. Rather than getting over the top with your body weight. That's a beautiful shot. Much better head position. Your head's forward and then you're hitting it on the ground. You're on top of the ball. Right, nice and sharp from ball one. Lovely start. Okay, I don't want you to rush. Okay, leave that, leave that. In between balls, get yourself set. I want your routine to be really important this session and then every ball you're going to fully commit to your shot. Good job boys, excellent. Beautiful feet mate, beautiful shot. Full commitment, excellent. Okay, 
Try and hold that top wrist, that should be coming through here. Not bad. In an ideal world, you block that straighter though. Okay, rather than to cover, it's an off stump, you block it right to me. Okay, get your weight right over your front knee. Okay, not there to hit. Not there to hit at all. You just want the wrong ball. That's the ball you probably need to leave. Yeah, so just stay sharp in your mind. Just like your dad said, technically you're good. First few shots, brilliant. Just didn't go at the right ball there. Take your time. Decision making is as important as your technique. What was that one? Front of the hand. Very good. You're the only one I picked today. <laughs> I just experimented with it in the back garden. Good on you, mate. That's quite how you learn. That's it. Watch the ball. Exactly. Watch the ball. Your weight didn't really go at it that time. Yeah, I know. It was just kind of a half pass. Yeah. All good. All good. Relax. Relax. You're playing well. Well ball, well played, good feet. Well ball. And again, all good. I think you're slightly technically just getting over here. Thanks. But as I release the ball, yeah. try and get your trigger and try and push your head to your brother. Okay. So you're sort of coming leg side, not across. See, you've got now two fullies. You could be like, oh, oh I'm not bowling Paul. You could be like, all oh, good, next ball. Yeah, next exactly. ball. Works through your bowling as well. Next ball. All that matters is the next ball. Bowled. Oh, and I think especially, like I was saying, with Hardman bowling, or leg spin bowling in general, it's practice is a big thing. Definitely. Because I've been bowling what? Try and get across. Cover that off stump. I have been bowled in what a week and a half. My yeah. first two balls were thinking shit. Yeah, you just gotta just ease into it then. Don't have too high expectations. Bold. All good. Oh. Bold. Shot. Oh. Well bold. In the game then. Well that. Because the bowler's gonna come to you if you leave it. Yeah. You just hang it, they'll stay there. And then I'll put it back. Exactly. Excellent, that's the best ball. Well bold. Ah, oh, big Joey took me down there at the end, some lovely shots. It's just working on trying to slow him action down a bit. Haven't bowled a whole lot last few weeks, last month or so. Felt like it was coming out really nice there. I was just slowing him action down. When I was a bit rushed, I was dragging him down. Or a bit slow, went too high, but rather over pitch than under pitch. So hopefully, should get a few overs tomorrow if the weather's all right. Just got to work on nice and slow and trusting myself in the game, not trying to rush through. Hey vlog, back at Crouch End in the place uh, that I'm staying, the families that puts me up whenever I'm in London. Uh, got absolutely soaking at the end, but fortunately got most of my sessions in. I got five full sessions and then 45 minutes of the last session in before the downpour and then absolutely drenched on the way home. Now just uploading some footage that I took today. I've got the camera down there charging, but trying to get footage off the SD card. 
things that happen behind the scenes to make these sort of videos. Um, and then I'm just going to have a quick turnaround, get changed, going to meet my good mate Angus Robson uh, for dinner and also Steve Smith. So looking forward to catching up with those boys. Obviously, um, Angus is one of my close mates and Steve I know a little bit, so it'll be good to see him after the week he's had. Um, he's on top of the world, I'm sure. So looking forward to seeing those boys. Hey vlog, just in Soho, just walking to the pub to meet the boys. Uh, nice little laneway and thankfully the rain has stopped. Anyway, I'll leave it there for today. Hope you've enjoyed today's vlog. Game day tomorrow. Hopefully the weather holds out. We can look pretty good today, so fingers crossed we can get on. We lost to them last time. So we're, we are on one. We're due to get the job done, hopefully. So, yeah, cheers for watching. Please like, comment, share, etc. And I'll see you soon, legends. Thanks a lot for watching this video. I really appreciate you taking your time out of your busy life to watch this video. I hope you enjoyed it. And if you got some value, please subscribe below. Hit subscribe to our channel. We, we try and publish some really interesting and valuable content for you guys, so subscribe if you haven't done so already. Check out our next two videos here below. Make sure you subscribe and also turn on post notifications and join the CM community by purchasing some merchandise. Link is in the description below. Thanks, legends. Now go out and get it done.